Hello everyone. So this is the $29.99 Animal Party Bouncer from Fisher Price. So you can see it's kind of a simple child seat bouncer to play in. Some toys. So overall it has a simple yet good design. It's, a, it's designed in this metal tubing. So it kind of just goes all the way around and uses kind of the bending of the metal itself to and the base here to kind of provide a little bounce. Overall it's just four screws to assemble and I think it's really a pretty good product for $29. This is the toy bar. It attaches to the top of the seat. Just provides kind of some things for the kid to play with. It's pretty basic but I mean this set is only $25 to $29 so I mean you can't really expect too much. Now the toy bar just kind of clicks in just as you can see. You just want to actually make sure it goes for the click because it kind of it can be a little wobbly so if you don't push it in all the way it doesn't it looks like it's in but it's actually not in see so this also means you can easily remove it so to assemble the seat there are only four screws required they're all phillips head and two of them go in the back one for each of the feet as you can see they're kind of a little rubberized and kind of prevent it, the seat kind of from sliding around it actually works pretty well and it's, it's really not easy to make it slide now the last two screws are on the back of each leg. They kind of join the structure of the seat. So they're pretty much the only important kind of joining point in the whole structure. Now the only thing about the seat I kind of don't like is that the battery is D size. So you know, most of us do not have a D size battery. You also do need a Phillips head screwdriver to open the battery compartment. Now, just open it up here. As you can see, just one large D battery. And all it really does is just vibrate. Now the seat itself is made of kind of like a simple soft fabric material, almost like a sailcloth. It feels durable. Uh, I mean, obviously, if you punctured it with something, it, w it would rip easily, but I think it has no issues holding a child, and it feels soft, comfy, and easy to remove and replace and install. So I have no complaints here. So in conclusion, I think this is a great seat for $29. The only real issue that I don't like is that there are D-sized batteries, which most people do not have at home, and uh, you know probably don't have rechargeable versions of. But, uh, I mean, this is a very simple product, so things like that can be overlooked. Everything else, its strength, reliability, comfort, ease of assembly, I think it's pretty much top-notch.